phonemic awareness versus phonics. Those two terms are often used interchangeably. However, they both play an essential role when it comes to helping our students become skilled readers. Anyone who teaches reading should understand the distinction between the two. Let's begin by talking about a phoneme. A phoneme is the smallest unit of sound in a word. For example, the word mop has three phonemes. M, A, P. But the word duck also has three phonemes. D, A, K. Even though we all know there are four letters or graphemes in that word. A phoneme is not the same thing as a printed letter. Phonemic awareness can be done with our eyes closed while phonics involves the letters that we see. Phonemic awareness instruction should be practiced daily. Students lacking those skills will be unable to segment a word into individual sounds, to blend those sounds to make a word, or to manipulate the sounds within a word. I like to do this with an easy game called dribble, dribble, shoot. Let's take the word dog. D -o -g, dog, and then we shoot it in. If your children struggle with three phoneme words, you can make it easier with two phonemes with this game I call hand, hand, clap. Up, up, and then put the word together. Phonics involves matching those sounds with individual letters. Phonics helps students decode words, and this means that they use that letter sound relationship to translate a printed word into a spoken one. Both phonics and phonemic awareness are essential components of the science of reading approach. They do not have to be taught in isolation, but they both should be practiced daily with anyone who is learning to read.